Twitch. It's your boys, Richard Mullet here, uh, directing team of Pod Slam Live Podcast Marathon benefiting Connor's Cure, taking place tomorrow at the IO Theater from 1 p.m. to 1 a.m. and also streaming live on Twitch and streaming audio live on arcadeaudio.net slash Podslam Central. Central, <laughs> Central time. time. Yes. Uh, thank you so much uh, for, I, I feel like this is a douchey YouTube thing to do. Like, I want to just thank you so much Appreciate for being you. here. It's like uh, uh, Paula Tompkins calls this the Jeremy Pippen move. <laughs> <laughs> He's a, uh, he has a very bad CBS show coming out. Paul of Tompkins? No, Jimmy, Jimmy oh, Kevin. No, it's very oh, sad. A CBS Paul of Tompkins show would be amazing. That would be yeah. very uh, subversive. Uh, Jeremy yeah. Piven's CBS show will last six weeks. Uh, th- we're not here to talk about Jeremy Piven, I swear to God. We're here to... <laughs> you get back here <laughs> and finish your beer. 11 a.m. beer. Uh, cool. What we are here to do is uh, go over and reveal all the cool stuff that uh, we will be... Uh, auctioning off, uh, giving away as prizes, um, uh, just kind of some of them door prizes, some of them trivia prizes. Also want to give a shout out um, to uh, One Hour Tees and Pro Wrestling Tees for this year's uh, Pod Slam volunteer shirt. Um, big shout out to them, third year in a row. They did these as well last year. So pretty. Um, third year in a row, really helping us out and keeping our volunteers <laughs> Uh, looking fresh. Absolutely. Um, if you if you've been to the events the past couple years, you know you're familiar with this whole process. Last year we did the live unboxing. I'm pretty sure we posted it up. So uh, it's the third one. So it's bigger. It's better. It's better. Uh, so we have so much more from so many different places. And as usual, I predominantly know everything that's in here, except potentially what's in some of the high spot stuff. Yes. Because uh, high spots has been a kind of an unspoken sponsor of us, and that like. Every year, I, I inquire, they deliver, and I'm like, hey, thank you so much. Like, can, can we do anything for you guys? And they're, just, they're like, no, we're good. <laughs> they're like our uh, silent benefactor. Yeah, they're like our Koch brothers. There you go. <laughs> but a lot less. Uh, mal- uh, 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 mal- uh, I was going to say Maleficent. Mal- Maleficent, there, yeah, they're definitely not involved in sleeping. <laughs> less uh, malfeasance. Thank there you. There you go. Uh, Quit me in the camera. Uh, oh, so yeah, here's so, some uh, index cards. Oh, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the book. Oh, damn it, I didn't have to steal that from Mark. Okay. <laughs> uh, so here's just some stuff uh, that we still have from the l- last two years. Two years. Um, that's how much stuff we have to give away. And I think we'll have a lot more this year. Um, and I still have Skylar's stuff, his books, and the gold Oh, figures. Jesus. I still have <laughs> them. But yeah, if I uh, still have a, a, an Xbox 360, uh, uh, an Undertaker skin uh, for that. That's at this point. This is approaching the uh, the like the age of the actual Undertaker skin. <laughs> the same thing with this uh, this PlayStation Two Slim skin with uh, Undertaker and movie star David Bautista. You gotta set up a little. Oh, he's not here to use his, his amazing stacking abilities. Some old masks. Oh, the Super oh. Callow mask didn't go this year? Oh. Super Callow did not go last year, and he will go this year. Um, somewhere. He will go somewhere. <laughs> so we got some Lucha masks. They're for children, but your face can figure it out. If your dad needs a John Cena cell phone pouch, <laughs> <laughs> this is the best uh, matchup since Cena Reigns. It's true. You versus that flower. He has a little bitch flower. <laughs> VHS. VHS is WrestleMania 18 on VHS. I might just hand this to Nick Lathan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for real though. Uh, the other Mad Libs. Oh. Yeah. They actually have one thing filled out in it. So if we have some time to kill on uh, tomorrow, we might be doing this live. Look like how much Cesaro hates the word Libs. <laughs> these are actually just pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, actually, I thought I still had this. Son of a bitch. Yeah, yeah these are uh, like mystery Funko figures. Jake the Snake, Hulk Hogan. Taz Micro Brawler. Where did this come from? I've never seen this before. Uh, oh, um, <clears throat> a friend at work, uh, Michael Locke, uh, he uh, had like a, a wrestling crate and he had some stuff that he didn't want. Oh, yeah. And so he gave me some stuff and I forgot that I threw that in there. I'm, I'm just going to buy this probably. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have some DVDs. Yes, we do. We have Before They Were Stars, CM Punk. Uh, this is actually just the UFC fight on this DVD. <laughs> and then WrestleMania 15. Um... Oh yeah, I forgot that I, there's definitely some more stuff that I put in here. Some dog tags. There's a ton, there's a ton of trading cards in here. More dog tags. 
Um, oh, oh, oh. This Naomi card. Uh, and these are pretty cool. So this is Legends of Extreme Season 1 from Pro Wrestling Crate. Oh, these like the, the round table discussions? Uh, possibly, yeah. Oh, yeah, they, I see these on uh, the High Spots Network all the time. Yeah. Yeah, this is really, this will be really good to watch. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> well, then this is probably going to go the same route then. Uh, it's a lapel pin, a Ritter and Swanson. I'm guessing that's the street that ECW one? Yeah. Nice. Very cool. Hell yeah, pro wrestling great. So that's, that's the stuff that's from previous years. Ooh. Big knife. Yeah. <laughs> you think you know knives. Sorry. No, oh, you're fine. You think you know knives. No, I'm, I'm sorry. No, I know what you're referring to. Okay. We're grown men, I know what you're referring to. Okay, cool. You think oh. you know knives. Also. This is going to be a knife. Just remembered that I had these. Oh, yeah, I was wondering what the ago. hell that was. Uh, and these are uh, some pennants, some old WCW pennants. Uh, we have Goldberg here. Uh, we got Big Papa Pump. I still have mine at home. Uh, where did I get these? In St. Augustine? Somewhere yeah. like flea market for super cheap. DDP. <clears throat> NWO Wolfpack. Too sweet. I think I know the last one, right? NWO Black and White. And that's it. No. What we don't have any more disco Infernos. Oh, no! It's okay, because this one for will be their live upon <clears throat> uh, Just selling his personal belongings. He'll be, he'll be he'll be bouncing out the door. He'll be checking people out the door. Yeah, in like about five or ten years, once we've crushed pediatric cancer for good, this event will be to uh, give Disco Inferno money. Helping out. Gil Gilberti. <laughs> Look at this. Look at that knife. Courtesy of my good friend Scott's wedding. Room for you. We're First do, box here. This is a high. No, I know exactly what's in this box. Uh, high spots uh, always has some crazy, some insane deals. They're more insane than Don West's. Um, so months ago, they had a ten T-shirt for twenty dollars sale. That is just unbelievable. So I was like, okay, uh, yeah, hot slam. So uh, these are all uh, adult men larges <laughs> because that was what was I had that and. They're like small left, and you know, you know your audience. Um, and these, I, these I, I know what's in here. I know what's in here. Uh, and these are. I do not. Pretty, pretty great. Uh, there's always they throw extra stuff in there. Yeah. <laughs> A little boot. Whoa, Jesus. Is this handwritten? Uh, yes, it is. Oh my god. Uh, so Boom the Bounty Hunter, starring. John our, our friend, John Yeah. Wilson, who said, uh, something I've learned from my career in pro wrestling is that people watch to be entertained, and people respond to different things. The action, the one-liners, the story, etc. Create something in which you believe all those things are awesome and people are going to like it. Signed, John Hennigan. Watch our Boone the Bounty Hunter trailer on YouTube and Facebook. Please comment and share. Uh, that's a sentiment, like, very... Very in the spirit of yes, Mod Slam. Absolutely. That's so really yeah, cool. This, uh, yeah, so you want to uh, sign Boone the Bounty Hunter... Uh, poster. You are getting pots in. Cool. Uh, more just stuff. Yeah, swag. All right. There's ten shirts. Here we go. I think I when I went through them, there's two on top that are like actually really good. I like, already see the Impact Wrestling logo. Get ready to see it a lot. No. <laughs> 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 but that one's okay. Oh shit. Yeah. All right. EC3. EC3. Or Gucci. Trouble. Whichever. Yeah. <laughs> If, if you think that you can complain about what's on the back of WWE shirts, yeah, just wait until you go through some Impact Wrestling shirts. Um, we have. But I, I almost kept this one. WWE WrestleMania 26. Yep, the official uh, shirt. I don't see Justin Gabriel on here. That was 27. That was 27. No. Yeah, because Nexus. The no. NXT had just started. Positive. No. Yeah, pretty positive. sure. No, NXT hadn't started. I'm pretty yet. sure. I'm pretty sure he was. Pretty sure. See, no, look, fucking NXT. As a logo, but the show hadn't officially started. Yet. It was WrestleMania. It was WrestleMania 27. Core versus Fluke Four. Justin Gabriel was part of the core. Thank you, Witten, for your core knowledge. Here's a Paul Orndorff card. <laughs> <laughs> I got Orndorff. <laughs> Yeah, just like that backstage, just like you got Orndorff. It sounds like, it sounds like a shitty thing that happened. Oh, what buddy. the heck? Oh, Brooklyn, like Brooklyn. I'm sure. Off of Fly Avenue and Beast Boulevard. Which like is actually, 
in the style of Air like brushed. one of those, yeah, like airbrushed, uh, uh, like flea market shirts. And the back, back just yo 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 <laughs> One time Sheldon Benjamin can get on the cover of a shirt. Uh, it looks like the top, yeah, oh yeah, that's why it was on the top of the, of the card, was the tag team match. Oh, it was Jericho yeah. and DX. Was uh, Chris Jericho legitimizing the tag titles for six months and Triple H being like, I want those now. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Paul and Stephanie, for supporting Congress here. Oh. We're still learning to wrestle. Um, the P of the to our crowd. That is a beautiful people shirt. Oh. And Tope, thanks for not showing up. So are we saving this for Tope then? Probably. <laughs> What's on the back of it? Uh, just the Impact Wrestling one. Oh shit, that was tasteful. <laughs> <laughs> I was fully anticipating something. Although great. they're all black shirts too. There's like no variety. Oh uh, boy, I got a feeling about this one. What the f what the hell? Oh my god. Oh, it's a GFW's current superstar, Bobby Roode shirt. This is a new <laughs> generation. This is a generation of selfishness. And I am the leader of the new generation, Bobby Roode. Is there something on the back still? Is that like a, the, the rest of the preamble on the yeah, back? Yeah, it says selfish generation. The title of the manifesto that this shirt is. All right. One of the most hideous things. a good things. sleep shirt. Looks, <laughs> looks like one of those things where you're trying to write big on a poster and then you went too big, so you're trying to go small to finish it. Um, nothing on the back of this one. It's just a black t-shirt. So I just get to reveal. Uh, oh, boy. From 2015, Maximum Impact 7. Yeah, the whole roster. Can I name... I want to see if I can legitimately name all these people very, very uh, I think it's possible. James Storm, uh, Bobby Lashley, Loki, MVP, Kurt Angle, Bobby Roode, Austin Aries, Kenny King, Samoa Joe, Eric Young, uh, Manic, Sonata, <laughs> which is hilarious, yeah. EC3, Abyss, Mahabali Shara, uh, Tyrus, Matt Hardy, uh, Eddie Edwards, Davey Richards, Spud, Kennedy, Magnus, Robbie E, Awesome Kong, Bram, uh, Mandrews. Uh, oh, oh no, uh oh, uh oh. No, that's, no, he's over there. Oh god. Oh no. Uh, Gil Kim. Uh, Al Snow, Grado. I think that's Dave Mastiff. DJ Z. Uh, Godders. What happened to Crazy Steve? Uh, Angelina Love. Uh, is that Noam Dar on the top? I think so. Oh, shit. Madison Rain, Rusev, um. <laughs> Terrence Terrell, Brooke Tessmacher, I don't know who that is. And I don't, uh, that Kaylee Ray, I think, actually, too. Oh. And I don't know who these two fucking guys are. Uh, guy in the long shirt's Gunner. Is it really? That's Gunner, yeah. That's Gunner? And then, and then the, uh, the guy behind him is that army vet. Oh, Chris Melendez? From, uh, SVU, the Melendez murders, starting in just a couple weeks. <laughs> Good job, show off. <laughs> This is a shirt. This is a shirt. <laughs> that is a fact. And on the back, it just says best pay per view matches 2009 2010. I don't know what else to say about can this. You na can you name the matches? Oh, no. I think he's in the wrestlers. I'm like, yeah, Randy Orton, Sean Michaels, yeah. Ray Mysterio. No, I, I think like, they always make shirts for like their DVD releases. Um, <clears throat> yeah, they do. No. <laughs> <laughs> they sure do. They sure do. <laughs> Who are these for? Well, can I think they're for you tomorrow at Pod Slam? They, uh, I think they, when they send mailers out, they send shirts too to like encourage people like advertise them. I guess. What is this? I don't even know. What? <laughs> I forgot that was in there. You can be a wrestler if you want. Oh, it's from a uh, figure company, Inc. So like they make action figures. So it's like an action figure. You're the figure shirt. It looks like a mixture of Triple H, CM Punk, and... That will never happen. Yeah, I know, right? Good. Who, who drew that? Whoever drew that does not ha know an actual representation of the human body. Box one. In the books. In the books. 
Uh, do this one next? Yes, do that one next. Now, fair warning, there's gonna be stuff that comes out of this box that's also like not specifically for Pod Slam. Yeah, <laughs> some of it is for personal. Yeah, because I the last minute thing, I had to send some stuff up. So, but there is still a, a couple things in there that are that are quite quite meaty. Making you nervous? Also, in case anyone uh, wasn't aware, of course, breathing. the main event of tonight, after we, uh, the main event of this video, after we finish um, opening these boxes, I already see something that pisses me off. Uh, <laughs> for real? Yeah. Uh, Michael Whitten will uh, finish uh, his duty as uh, as what I put. Oh, they messed up all the girls, the beards! Oh, that. <laughs> oh, no, I didn't see. Michael Whitten will uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin smash mayonnaise canisters together and chug them. Uh, yeah, this this box went through UPS, USP mail. Uh, when you come out the Pod Slam, you best believe you're gonna get some photocopy pictures of Colonel De Beers. Get ready to hear a lot of Colonel De Beers. Uh, those yeah, those are just supplies. Pads, those ballpoint pens. Yep. Um, this, so this is just for me. Yes, this is just for you. I hate you. This is <laughs> so much. I didn't get an opportunity to tie a little bandage around his leg like I was going to, but uh, this is a Ryan Tannehill wrestling buddy, essentially, um, that I got on clearance <laughs> at Toys R Us, and I, it wouldn't fit in your birthday box. Oh, okay. Well, so, yeah, so he's now the third cut out of us. Here we go. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. No, he's not going to stand. So. Nope. Uh, oh, hey. So yeah. I have some WWE loot crate stuff in here. Some uh, exclusive Sasha Banks glasses. These are unpracticable. <laughs> <laughs> They're extremely difficult to use. Uh, we have an official Mitch the Plant. Oh, is that what this is? So it is a plant that <laughs> has Mitch on the on the pot. And, and there's you, like seeds. Yeah, you can just grow oh, your own awesome. Mitch. Bring back Mitch. Yeah, Mitch. What what, what won't they the, sell? I know, exactly. I, before Daryl Takahashi, this was the best non-wrestler of the year, all right? Oh, now the original Colonel Beers. Beers. Yeah. Oh, don't worry. I have a special plan in mind oh, for this right. pristine Colonel Beers. A uh, ton of these little nano mm -hmm. metal figs. They, they started making these at, uh, at Walmart. They're like 88 cents or something, and there's like little cool like little yeah. trinkets. So got the Rock. I think we have like 15 Dean of them Ambrose. in there. Uh, Jericho, Sting, Reigns, Charlotte, ton of them, ton of them. That's just the stuff that came in the slam. Okay. Uh, more stuff there. Um, an Austin Aries rookie card. <laughs> that will forever stay a rookie That's card. Then we have a 39 year old rookie card. Zayn and Cena. Uh, Bailey. Uh, ooh, oh, that's really cool. An NXT iron on patch uh, for your denim vests. <laughs> yeah. Uh, some trading cards. Look for the exclusive Undertaker tribute cards because oh, he is, is retired. Uh, this one's for you, Wynn. Triple H. Yep. Yep. Uh, and the video game. <laughs> <laughs> A PlayStation. What was this called? A PSP? PlayStation PSP. <laughs> PlayStation Portable. Portable, yeah. SmackDown vs. Raw. 2008. Featuring ECW. Yeah. I think there's five ECW guys in the game. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? That, I believe, is a Dean Ambrose belt buckle. Oh, that's cool. Mm. Again, I don't want to unwrap it, but yeah. yeah, that's pretty cool. Hey, dude. Mystery. Ooh, it's, I'm pretty sure it's the DA logo. Keep... Protect the biz. Oh, sorry. So this is actually really this is cool. Interesting. So uh, I go to a lot of uh, small little local comic cons in Orlando, Florida, and I always see this guy there, and he has like a Nikolai Volkov comic. So I walk by him, and he's branching out and doing a lot more like history of old wrestler comic books. So I picked up the Killer Bees one. He's got the Fantastics. He's got Hacksaw Jim Duggan one he's working oh. on. Brian Knobs was there, so he was bombarding him trying to <laughs> trying to get the rights to do the next. Come on, one. man! The rights to make me a thing. Wait, <laughs> who was bombarding who? Uh, I think it was kind of a mutual thing. Oh, they good for they them. both were annoyed at one another. They found each other. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, this is a, just a cool little uh, uh, original comic book. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is my second championship power that I'm using because for the donation of five dollars, Rich Camelucci has donated to Connor's Cure and has bought this official T.J. Perkins. Dabbing 8-bit t-shirt <laughs> that exists. I made sure I got his size and everything. 
You're making a difference, man. For five dollars. What? You gonna put it on? <laughs> I saw that and I was like, I. Oh. Thankfully, it, saw it. it was online. No, it was at an FYE. Cause they were like a huge. And I bought it, and the guy was a wrestling fan. He was like, I can't believe you're buying this. <laughs> and I explained it to him. I yeah, was it's like, like, oh, it's a rim. Yeah. Again, it was going to be in your birthday box, but then I became champion, so mm -hmm. I was like, I'll just use my second power on that. Oh, cool. So you owe five bucks for this. I need to get it. <laughs> uh, some more metal figs. Uh, Randy Savage, that's a pretty cool one. Ooh. And Undertaker. That, uh, that bag there is for Robert, so I'm just going like, to oh, sure, 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 sure. More cards. Yep. Jesus, yeah, it is for Robert. Yep. Fun of comics. Yep. <clears throat> I'll pull this one out. Uh, this is the last slam here, and the coolest one, I think. Uh, this is a uh, the box got a little uh, minorly messed up. Let's look at it. A New Day's bootyful moment. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it is the New Day on a unicorn with sneakers. Um, yeah, just really, really cool. Really nice. That's uh, pretty cool. Cool crate exclusive. Again, I've said it, I say it every year. I don't like the racial overtones of this product, but um, yeah, it's still good. Uh, <clears throat> as a little bit of a, a promo for. Arcade Audio, the host of this event, um, they will have a bunch of uh, buttons. Uh, Second year in a row. Yeah. Shout out to Kate just, Wright Shop in Orlando, Florida for hooking us up yeah. as, as always. Just, you know, swag. Cool swag. Um, there's a Pod Slam one in here. Uh, there's an Arcade Audio one in here. There's Humanoid Resources, Riverside Falls, and Our Father, which you will be able to see all of those shows at Pod Slam 2017 tomorrow. The IO theater. Do you want to you want to tell the people on Twitch who the special guest with our father is? Uh, the special guest for our father, uh, the 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 one stepping into the confessional, uh, is going to be Chicago legendary improviser T.J. Jagodowski, uh, <clears throat> known on a national level as uh, uh, being in guy the, on left <laughs> in the Sonic in the passenger seat. Yeah, um, and also could have been on SNL, but he has vertigo. There you go. So something about like the depth of the studio. Is this Great. a thing here or is this? Uh, that's a thing for you. Okay. Uh, so you can open I... it now if you want on camera or you can open well, it That's just self-indulgent. <laughs> well, this is halftime. It's <laughs> halftime, yeah. Um, right. This is, uh, I'll explain afterwards why this is uh, just proof that Rich and I know each other extremely well. And anything you just saw with the back of it. I saw a logo. Nothing has to do with Oh my uh, god, you. You! Nothing has to do with five. You! I just talked about the local Comic Cons, and I hope they did that package justice. Oh, I think so. If, uh, if, you know, one thing about Rich Camelucci is that he is a Ghostbusters freak. Um, not as more so in wrestling, because, you know, we haven't done Ghost Slam yet. Don't want to don't impede on Trap Ravens. Um, yeah, Sam wanted to make sure that you <laughs> it was protected. <laughs> God. Like one, of the most, one of the most immaculate looking real Ghostbusters figures I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my god. And it was even better before it got Did that? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> that is still amazing. Oh my god. This was one of my favorites. Yeah. Uh, dang. Show right. the people that... Sorry, it's just <laughs> indulging. I don't... Uh, uh, I'll go in depth on that later. <clears throat> okay. Um, thank you so much for that, dude. Um, yeah, it gets, I almost kept it for myself. It gets put on the and table. And it as a championship power, and, and I was like... It's also very cool. Yeah, it was, it was a story that was cool. <laughs> but enough about us. A love and friendship. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into... Box two. In the books. books. Let's do the WWE one. So I ordered this Ooh, months baby. ago. I don't even remember what's in it. I remember one thing that's in this box. One thing that's in this box. And what's for what's for Gile mean? French. Ah. Could be the deed. <laughs> <laughs> oh damn! Oh my god! Oh, we got some beef jerky. <laughs> Jr's Pepper Power Slam beef jerky. That looks like it'd make me go to the bathroom. <laughs> Lots of busting. 
dang, this is cool. That is bad. Money in the bank, oh. lunchbox. Oh. Cash in every day at work while you're hungry. <laughs> He's cashing in on his tuna sandwich. Yeah. Oh, looks like we have some, uh, some, some drinkware, some glassware. Should I even? No, I think we'd leave it in because you can see up the yeah. outside of it. Uh, so this is a uh, a sting pint glass. I don't know if you can see through that. Yeah. You can. Yeah. Uh, if you come over to the company earlier, scene, you know how many th you could have had a whole dinner set of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> one tumbler. Oh, this is a heavy one. I can't see. This is a mug. I think that's a beer stein. Yeah. Uh, I like to make it just open. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, because it's like frosted on there. Ooh, very nice. Oh. A Valor Club beer mug. Yeah, that's. This is like good quality. This is good good quality stuff. stuff. Yes. <laughs> it's like on. Good quality. Feels good in my hand. i work right now. Just, oh, and just feel that. It feels great. Toners dialing in, letting us know. We are sold out of the Ballard Club mug. We only have one of them. Uh, this looks to be a uh, Becky Lynch set. You got some steampunk goggles in there. Yep. Oh, we can open this up. This is not... Yeah, I don't know why they wrapped that yeah, up. Yeah, this is fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, got some steampunk goggles. goggles uh, as well as... Uh, some wrist... Oh, a page wrist cuff. Uh, I ordered this a uh, long time ago. <laughs> well, it will be, it'll come back up. This is like a little, de uh, I almost said Divas, wow, forget me. Uh, and a Carmella uh, necklace uh, with the, the sneakers and the C and all that stuff. That's heavy too. Yeah, I know, right? Damn. Yeah. I was insinuating something else about this. Uh, this next item, I can vouch for the quality of the. Uh, of the cup anyway, because I have two WWE mugs at work. Mm -hmm. um, here is a big cast of Enzo. An actual uh, cup of haters. Yeah, a cup of haters. Maybe I should have waited on this stuff, could have got it for much. <laughs> <laughs> and then, <clears throat> another mug. <clears throat> Every day, you're going to work. Your champ. That's it, the champ is here. Um, this is just cute, a little WrestleMania, WrestleMania bear. Oh, bear. This season, I haven't got the old time. Oh, look at this. A certified G Enzo Amore hair. Oh. <laughs> that's, that's the one thing I remember that was in here was an Enzo wig, which I am wearing. Ooh. That was for, that's for me. Oh, okay. <laughs> well then. Uh, more shirts. Uh, what is, oh, New Day socks. New Day socks. Oh. An actual New Day socks, it works. Well, the downstairs one. Us. Oh. I'm assuming the suspenser. Oh, probably. New big socks. That is awesome. Yes. I may get those and wear those to doctor's also offices. Also awesome. Bro me. Oh. <laughs> uh, it pained me so. Spencer is here. Spencer, say hi to the Twitch universe. All right. <laughs> <laughs> or do a Nixon impression. <laughs> uh, what do we got here? We have... Uh, I think that's a bought Villain shirt. Oh, it yeah. is a Vaude Village. Quite Manly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite Manly. Uh, cool. We'll leave that in the packaging as well. <laughs> oh, we the no. people shirt. <laughs> I think undoubtedly the cheapest thing I've ever bought on a WWE shop. Uh, and again, just another very useful item. A phenomenal one uh, bag. Nice. Yeah. Very nice. I hope they got a, a backpack like this last year in London. Cool. Right. Box three in the books. Let's do the uh, Thompson stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna go get that right now. Look at look at all this amazing stuff. See, I'm not as good as Augie was last year. Augie had it set up like a like a oh, giant right, fucking yeah. hall, and I'm just a monster. No, there's like some good stuff in there. Oh, uh, there's a lot of really you really good stuff. You actually cash in your lunch yeah. every single day. These are all T-shirts. Yeah, yeah. largely uh, TNA. I got this thing. Um. Uh, so what is in here was uh, donated by uh, Zach Thompson, uh, Chicago improviser, as well as uh, commentator uh, for R Pro Wrestling, as well as freelance wrestling here in Chicago. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and bust these out. Whoa! What, what the? What? I've never seen this setup. Oh, before. I like being on this side of it. Oh my god! 
Who do we got? Uh, we got Ken Shamrock in mid poop. <laughs> <laughs> we we got Kane, fifty pounds lighter. We have The Rock uh, just doing his damn eyebrow thing, and with the big boss man. I've never seen that before. <sighs> That's a good set. How yeah. Did wow. You look up uh, American Airlines shipping rules. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he uh, he sent me a picture of these, and I was just like, yeah, dude, I don't. I don't think I've ever even seen these before. Uh, Man. Yeah, this is another good one right here. I have wow. I have these two still at home. Stone Cold, Draws, uh, Gold Dust, and X-Pac. Dude, that Gold Dust is sick. That Gold yeah. Dust is really good. I, I can't think. imagine like this being sold anywhere other than like a Costco or something. Yeah, yeah like like because these were on their oh, own. Like, it's yeah, like the Bone Crunchers. Yeah, 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 these are the little Jacks ones. I feel like yeah. inside is the actual like. They are, yeah, yeah. So yeah. like, yeah, they must have just like had a deal, like you said, at like a wholesaler yeah. or something to do it. To you them. got a, you got somebody excited. Super Gay Bros said, "Yay, toys!" <laughs> Damn right. Toys. Oh, and also afterwards, I have a couple other toys to show you. The the commercials for this, I'm watching right in the Raws. I'm watching '97. They're doing commercials for this, and it's just the headbangers like slamming them into the lockers. These toys are some of the best. We got Titan Tron Live. So this is when they kind of switched over from the bone crunching. And these, like, <clears throat> didn't talk. Like, you had to put them through a set and it played their music. And they this one, they got the face scanning technology. Oh, wow. Technology really down. So, uh, X-Pac, The Rock, Undertaker with some big old titties. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh... Is that the giant? No, no that's, that's Road Dog. Road Dog. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was Triple H at first. Awesome. These are, are the last are one here. Nice. These are unreal. Yeah, Zach, thank you so much. At Pocket Thunder on Twitter, I believe. Um, he is a good, very good follow. And then, yeah. Yeah, buddy. Oh, this, is, this is the best one. That's the best one. Yeah. Yeah. That's... Holy crap, dude. That, this mankind is off the chain. Yeah. Dang. Dude, I might just bid for this myself. Yeah, oh, these will be silent auction items. These will be... God damn it. I'm gonna actually have to do this like an actual Southern Beat auction. Good <laughs> lord. And just that Stone Cold alone, like the, the detail on the jacket. Yeah. Yep. It's all this, this DTM, one. Don't trust anybody, you piece of trash. You damn right. Good, look at those. These are awesome. Thank you, Jack, so very, very much. We also have, man, I don't even wanna show these two figures. No, these yeah, are really good. Cool. They're still extremely old. Like, you wanna talk old and rare. Yeah. Shout out to the Brick and Back Collectible Store for these findings and purchases. Uh, original LJN Corporal Kirshner. Um, if you know anything about these toys, that is in fantastic condition. <laughs> yeah. Surprisingly. Is that is it possible or is that just it? I mean, yeah, he. No, yeah, it's, just, he, it's uh, just a big yeah. rubber. Yeah. yeah. Mess. And then uh, even older, uh, to my understanding, uh, some of the first wrestling toys ever made. This is a AWA Remco Steve Kern. Yeah. The date on the back says 1985. 1980. Wow. This is older than everybody in this room. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Uh, the AWA Remco's are a personal favorite of Marty DeRosa, uh, who you will be able to see live uh, with Marty and Sarah Love Wrestling uh, tomorrow night at 11 o'clock mm-hmm. at this thing called Pots Labor Going. Oh, is it yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not December 25th? Yeah. Uh, although good. this is like, this is my Christmas. It's very much it. It's seeing like all this cool stuff all right. that we'll hopefully find. Good. Last but certainly not least, every year we have the High Spots box. There could be some mysteries in here. Uh, they have been a fantastic follower and supporter of us. Spencer does not trust Rich with this knife. <laughs> Why is that knife so damn big? Because uh, it's got It was a groomsman gift. But is this supposed to be on the end of a, uh, a rifle? Uh, that's a this is, damn bayonet. This is elk horn. Okay. okay. That's that's Scott's grandfather, uh, like, got the elk and, like, made this and stuff like that. This was our groomsman gift. That doesn't explain the length of the blade. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 12 inches is just a good, you know, number. Yeah, nice, nice round. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a foot. Uh, right. Just make it a foot. Yeah. Just went up to the elk and be like, hey, can I borrow some of your antlers? And then we'll turn into, like, the uh, final tap. Like, but yeah, but it doesn't explain the length of the blade. Yeah, those are good. All right. And normally, as soon as it's open, this up, I can kind of tell. packed to the brim. Yeah. The man. Here's the, uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, as my God. right off the top. <laughs> Right off the top, they've added stuff again, so I can confirm. Oh boy, we got some extra. So yeah, things. shout! Thank oh, you so much, high spots. Up every bitch. time, I already saw it. <laughs> oh <wow. laughs> oh. <laughs> they said they got Tope last year, and they got me this year. That is huge. Oh, oh my god, that's amazing. Oh, I've missed cuddling something <laughs> on this trip. So. <laughs> Look, I was brought one on, on this trip. On they this they trip. can't do the Pepsi logo because it's it trademarked. So yeah, they did the a best. Blue, they did North, the French flag. No, <laughs> <laughs> Normally they don't even go there. They just leave a spot open. Yeah. So the fact that they even did something shows That's you right. know this is wild. 
Man. He's got his like knuckle tattoos. Yeah, of course they do. Uh, and his shitty elbow tattoo. Shut up, man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that is super wild. You're coming home with me. <laughs> My kid's going to love you. <laughs> uh, we have some Impact Wrestling uh, cups. Oh, that's awesome. Again? Uh, all with Jeff, Jeff Hardy. Hardy. Yeah, it's all the same. Well, it's not Jeff Hardy. That's Willow. Uh, no. That's, 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 that's Jeff Hardy. That's Jeff Hardy. That's Jeff Hardy. I'll, I'll show you Willow. And if they were Willow uh, yeah, cup, I'd be halfway to the post office already <laughs> sending that the tote bag. <laughs> that beautiful people shirt. Uh... Dang! That is, is like the entire collection of 1993. Uh, again, didn't order that. <laughs> they sent that to us. What is this? Uh, so they're trading cards from uh, like the summer of 93. Because I think Luger's on the package, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, whoa, cool. Yeah. yeah. They sent like 50 packs of them. <laughs> yeah. There are. Dude, there might be a charge so in one. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, think more like a fashion booger. Yeah, that's equivalent. So not only that, but you also have uh, the that Enigma would... Jeff Hardy playing cards. Those are going to be fun to, to look I at. I hope they have his custom artwork. <laughs> Those I actually bought. <laughs> that's the first thing out of coming out of the box that I actually bought. An another me, Jin. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so as soon as you break it out of the box, just that staring the at you. The fuck are the Jokers? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just even kookier faces. Yeah. Oh, uh, these are wonderful. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, can we put these of back course. in the box? This is what we're uh, using to play poker this weekend. Uh, a ton of Hulkamania wristbands. Oh. Hulk Hogan and Livestrong can join together. That sounds about right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, there's some other ones in here as well. What do we got? It's just Ch chain gang soldier. Oh, yeah. I love every year when I send that email. They're like, "Oh, absolutely. We've been, we've been looking to get rid of this and stuff." <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. Where's chain gang for? soldier from? It was uh, Cena used to call his fans the chain gang. I guess. Yeah. Because oh, it's like like a necklace, like a chain. Well, yeah, he used to have like uh, like the wrapper chain okay. around his neck, and you know. And the black one is a uh, Rey Mysterio. Nice. I am wild about these trading cards. Yeah, so yeah, 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 yeah I'm a sucker. Trade cards. Yeah. So many. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they sent us a bunch of these. Oh, cool. So we can actually. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I was like, oh, yeah. you can't play poker with this because they're going to give them away. No, nope. we have. They got us covered. <laughs> we can play fucking blackjack. <laughs> okay. I don't know what. This oh, is. I saw a face. There's a face. Yeah, there's a few of these. Oh, are these gonna be like knockout banners? Oh boy! I saw these and oh, I didn't. Boy. I didn't buy them because <laughs> I was like, man, that's gonna be perverted. But if wow. you want to send it to us, go for it. That's insane. <laughs> we are crushing pediatric cancer. Is this well, supposed to be like? Uh, I think did they do a secret Moulin Rouge video? <laughs> you tell anybody? This looks like something you walk through to get your fucking palm red. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I, again, I was, I was like, man, okay. Spencer, gonna be, can you fold this up? Yeah. I'm, be, I'm a little bit more tasteful. <laughs> they sent it to us anyway. They have two of them. There's two of them. <laughs> I'm waiting. Here's your bag. <laughs> there's someone, I was going to say, send it to Tope. Uh, there's another one here, too. I don't even know what this could be. Oh, my God. Yeah, just, just, there's going to be somebody there who wants that. High spots, you never fail to disappoint. Wait. No, oh, you wait. never fail. You, you, you never fail to not disappoint. Yeah. <laughs> Just you never fail to amaze us. Yeah, this is definitely meant. Oh my god. Is that a giant is it Kurt Angle? Yeah, it is. And then, and then turn it around. That's what's happening here. Turn... <laughs> Alright, and you gotta flip it around. Oh, it's like this? Because it's, cause it's his last name's on the bottom. It's on oh the bottom. no, your, your, your part goes on the bottom. Yeah, bitch. Okay. Now turn it. Now. This, there we go. Okay. There we go. That's nightmare-inducing. What does it say in the bottom? It says angle. It says oh, no, angle. It's, it's, turn it around. Flip it. <laughs> there we go. are there four grown-ass men. <laughs> oh, okay. So he just like stole the... He stole Steve Austin who stole Terminator. Yes. All right. <laughs> hey, hold that knock knockout one up again. <laughs> uh, yeah, when you're done. Thank you, Spencer. Uh, so many DVDs! Awesome. Oh, they, they probably added more things. I think only bought like three or four. Oh, this is like 20. Yeah! We have uh, FIP, the usual suspects with CM Punk on the cover. And Jamie Noble and weird Dave Prezak. Yeah. 
Uh, FIP, Unstoppable, with Colt, Punk, Joe, uh, Kendrick. Uh, who's that other dude? Is that one? Uh, that is, I have no idea. I've been watching wrestling 30 years. Oh, no, that's Sal Renaro, I think. Oh, cool. And these are from 2005, so it's like one of the hot years of ROH. Yeah, these are all in Florida. Oh, cool. Yeah, these are like maybe some of Punk's like last independent shows. <laughs> uh, here, go ahead. And look oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In, in this. Oh, yeah. Um, another, uh, F- yeah, another FIP show, Unfinished Business. Joe, Strong, Punk. Is that Homicide? Jamie Noble. Uh, yeah, this is crazy. Oh, and Roderick, yeah, Roderick, Roderick in the front. This would also be like, like, Independent wrestling show names or like cops episodes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all these FIP DVDs. These are all like. I didn't order a single one of these. Look, is that uh, is that Eric Stevens? Yeah. I think so. Man, Eric, Eric Stevens. Stevens. <laughs> uh, is that? Yeah, Brian Danielson's on that one. Yeah, and BJ Whitmer. Yeah, and the and purple pants. The, uh, the... Oh, Purple Pants! Oh, the Purple Pants, your favorite. Oh, my God, another one. Oh, who's that up in the, the top left? Top left, that's, uh, Shingo, I think. Nice. Yeah, Shingo. More DVDs! Finally, these might be the actual ones I've ordered. Uh, Ernest P. Wo- uh, the Ernest P. World Memorial. <laughs> For PWG. <laughs> Early PWG. Yeah, show. wow. Where they were naming their stuff. Look at Kevin Owens. What he was Kevin Steen. Look how young he is there, man. Uh, I'll say that for last. Uh, Juggalo Championship Wrestling. Now we're talking. <laughs> at the 11th Annual Gathering of the Juggalos. You exclusive bet. three DVD set. You bet your ass Including Bloody Mania, Oddball Wrestling, and Flashlight Wrestling. Oh, Flash. that's where the uh, the audience is. It's There's no yeah, lights. Yeah, 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 oh yeah. my god. <laughs> Featuring Booker T, Corporal Robinson, The Haters, Butterbean. <laughs> <laughs> Sean Davari, the Briscoes. Why is Davari so far down on that list of the Briscoes? Raven, Kings of Wrestling, the Weed Man, <laughs> Joey Ryan, Road Dog, Tracy and Isabella Smothers, Isis. Todd, <laughs> <laughs> Todd Bridges. <laughs> Todd Bridges. <laughs> Do you need a cup? Mike Knox. Isis. <laughs> Balls Mahoney. <laughs> Bridges and Ice is back to back. And Terry Funk. <laughs> yeah, of course. We get some special and credit, you know, like, and Jack Nicholson. Flashlight and Wrestling featuring <coughs> Rock and Roll Express, Kamala, Cowboy, Bob Orton, Bullet Bob Armstrong, Eugene, Hacksaw Jim Duggan, Gangrel, Kevin Thorne, Dutch Mantel, Tommy Rich, Disco Inferno, PG-13, Brian Christopher, Ryan Garvin, and more. Commentary by Vinyl J and Corporal Robinson. Kind of a good DVD. Yeah. Uh, and then Oddball Wrestling featuring Sabu, Ring Riders, Too Tough Tony, Necro Butcher, Davari Bros, Cold Cabana, Madman Pondo, Masada, Ian Rotten, Bull Payne, Briar Wellington, and more. Commentary by Kevin Gill. Oh my god. Uh, ROH Straight Shooting Series, Bruno San Martino. Ooh. Hosted by Jim Cornette. I didn't like the men. Uh, West Virginia, under the bears on the bearskin rug interview series. Yeah, it's just gonna be weird. Road trip with Tracy Smothers and Paul London. Yeah. What in the world? I'm sure it's just a tasteful discussion between two men. <laughs> <laughs> on a bearskin rug. They have like topics on the back, uh, such as toll booth. Paul and Tracy make a new friend. <laughs> Uh, other topics include porn, oh, good. followed by kids. <laughs> That's how it works. <laughs> yeah. uh, and this last one here is uh, a DVD for Omega, Uncommon Passion. This is the promotion. It's the Hardy Boys the, run. The Hardy Boys run. Ran, run, I still don't even know. Who knows? There's, There's no probably like a 12 year old Shannon Moore on this show. <laughs> Came out last year. Oh, does um, this come out last year? I don't know. I don't oh. Know. <laughs> Here's another secret angle flag. Two! Oh my god. Ah, they're just shoving them in. Shoes in his packing. packing. <laughs> you want extra shit? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we're losing our minds. We really have to get all this to Iowa. <laughs> More Enigma cards. 
we're tied next. Oh, knockout oh, cards. Oh, knockout cards. Yeah. Uh, what do we got here? A a Jomo glass blown ornament. Oh. Augie, oh, bring your wallet. <laughs> He's gonna want that. That's not even for that. Just a reminder, Augie, to bring your fucking wallet. <laughs> Uh, pop a top with the Sinkara keychain uh, uh, bo- bottle opener. Mysticism. Mysteriosos. Uh, another knockouts uh, thing right there. A book. Mm. Pure dynamite. Oh dang. <clears throat> I guess this is the uh, the British or the uh, 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 dynamite, dynamite kid. kid. <laughs> <laughs> they found your one three letter word. Well, because they put here Tom British Bulldog Billington. Oh yeah, that's confusing. Yeah, so. Can see how that happened. Um, yeah, that's cool. Did the forward for this book? Um, everybody hates that. My kids. So I'm just curious if he even has a forward on it. British bulldog. Introdu- no, I don't see a forward. Yeah, I see an introduction, and there's a picture of him and Foley on the back. He like was killed Foley, and it's the first match. <laughs> uh, it's another shirt. I don't know what this is around. I remember about this. Is uh, a Viano. Shirt, you know the Vianos from WCW and L- AAA. For whatever reason, they had a shirt that had the Pink Panther in a Viano mask, and I saw this. And I was like, well, this is fucking awkward, so we're buying it. Um, I hope your shipping's ready again. <laughs> oh, don't worry. That's not leaving Chicago this time. Oh, uh, AAA twist mask for the second year in a row. I have to pretty much buy it every year because, like, then I'm like, all right, the box is, has to be that size, so they have to fill it up with stuff. <laughs> Yeah. Order a thing that can be also a container. This was the bane of my existence, sending this to Josh from the Heels and Heels last year. So this will not leave Chicago. This is a Chicago-only item. <laughs> Any guesses what this fucking is? Uh, <laughs> it's like another angle flag. No, I don't know if it is, is it? No, it's yeah, it is. <laughs> no. More cards. Good oh, as always, we got some 8x10s. 8x10s. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, we got a pirate Paul, Paul Virgil. Virgil. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Uh, we got Heidenreich and Animal. A who? Oh, that's so sad. Heidenreich, 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 Well! Now this is more like, huh? Okay. Uh, we got a, uh, uh, wow, man, Mark Marrow. Oh. That's your dude right I now. I kind of love Mark Marrow right now. Who's dude is dope, man? With his, with his, like, boxing gimmick, I really like that. Yeah. Uh, we have a WCW David Flair. There's one in the back uh, as well. Oh, is there? Oh, <laughs> and a Playboy Buddy Rose. Also, if Louis Louis Anderson was a wrestler, <laughs> I uh, worked hard for this body. <laughs> That's fun. Blow, blow, blow that weight away. Uh, we have a Perry Saturn from WCW, like, yeah. late... Very sad. In a dress <laughs> with weird glasses. Uh, and this is a oh. piece they resist. There's on. a certificate of yeah. authenticity <laughs> on the back of this. <laughs> not. What is it? It ensures well, that I know. I know. I know. It. Autographed <clears throat> by the actual wrestling <laughs> superstar. I wondered it. I know exactly who it is. Choo choo. Frank oh. Oh. And his smooth belly in the watch he got at that kiosk at the mall. Oh, <laughs> that's. That's beautiful. Yeah. We miss a freight train. And I can uh, I can attest I have a freight train autograph on a DVD. That, that is, is that, that is that autograph. Is autograph. autograph. Damn. More cards. More flags. Oh my god. You wanted to come uh, with fucking money. Oh wow, Ooh. Mick Foley's Halloween Hijinks. Yeah. This is, I've never seen this yeah. before. It's just, he did the Christmas book and then he did this one like the next year. This is awesome. Yeah, it's actually really good. Let me see some. Yeah. Oh, and, there's oh. stuff in here. And Jerry Lawler uh, did the artwork for it. Uh, what is this? This is a original AWA program. <laughs> wow. From, uh, what's the date on it? Uh, I think it's like October 70 something. I'll find it. They had a bunch of these. I just got one, but now they say how cool it is. Yeah, that is awesome. Yeah. That's like is, a good, like, frame piece. Yeah, this is like 40 years old. <laughs> no. This yeah, is, 40 years this old. This is awesome. Jerry uh, Waller is good. <laughs> yeah, he's... <laughs> this, uh, the official... The tonight's official lineup for July 31st, 1970. The main event, Vern Gundy versus Black Jack Lanza for the AWA... Wow. The AWA Championship. <laughs> and then the special event, Wilbur Snyder versus Bad Boy <laughs> Belinsky. Oh, and uh, Rich, uh, there's an added attraction match here. Who is that right there? The big cat Ernie Red. <laughs> yeah, I'm right. Put that back in the book. Yeah, yeah Jerry Lawler is a fantastic 
artist. Uh, he did incredible. One more book here. Uh, <coughs> looks like it's his autobiography. I um, think yeah. Gordon Soley, something left behind. A legendary uh, commentator for <laughs> NWA. This is going to be so big. Half this book is just going to be him drinking. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, uh, character from Semi Pro, the commentator, is based off of Gordon. Uh, uh, oh, two of these. Oh, oh, oh. I bet I know what one is. CM Punk. Oh, they're both! <laughs> Who do we got? CM Punk Bobbleheads. Oh, they're both CM Punk. Yeah. I think we had these last year. He looks like uh, Orlando Bloom and yeah. I forget who else. Looks like Sting a little bit. A little bit, yeah. In the face. And a uh, fledgling MMA player. <laughs> that's it. That's it? Yeah, wow. That's it. And that is, wow. as always, High Spots. Yeah. Thank you look, so much. Look for, at, at, look at this. Look at this. This is amazing. All of this can be yours. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to come and drop down? This, this is, yeah. <sighs> Buddy. Hot damn. Hot damn. I'm so stoked. One last hard sell. Give it to him. <sighs> Tomorrow, September 23rd, Saturday, at the IO Theater. If you're here in Chicago, uh, from 1 p.m. Central Standard Time to 1 a.m., uh, Pod Slam. Uh, and if you're not going to be here, you can listen live at arcadeaudio.net slash Pod Slam. You can watch live at this Twitch channel. Um, and we are raising money for Connor's Cure. There's a donate button at arcadeaudio.net slash Pod Slam. Uh, the shows are going to be amazing. Uh, Marty and Sarah love wrestling, not your demographic. Us of Pod Swoggle. Um, uh, our, our father, father TJ. featuring TJ Jaganowski. Uh, hot dang, there's going to be so many good shows. Uh, so many bits, talking wild. And where do they know TJ from? Uh, from the Sonic commercials. Yeah, he's, he's the guy with the red hair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, yeah, really. We have the uh, third annual Pod Swoggle also rumble this year featuring mystery entrance. You have no idea who's going to be coming up for that. It's incredible. And also the second annual Pod Swoggle Versus. Yep, uh, wrestling trivia game show. Um, uh, the show that we'll be doing to close out the night for Podswoggle, uh, we're going to do another Drunk History with uh, the storyteller himself right here. Uh, he's already getting ready. Um, if you have any suggestions for a topic, um, feel free to shoot them my way at Rich Cami on Twitter. Um, but yeah, hot dang, look at all this stuff. Am I, am I, I mean, I'm, of course I'm missing stuff. Because there's so much that's going to be happening. So much. Yeah. Uh, Fifteen dollar half day tickets, twenty dollar all day tickets. They're available all day. They're all available mm -hmm. online. Yes. All the proceeds go to Connor's here. Every little. Every thing. cent of your ticket sale goes to Connor's. And there's Spirit. not any donation that's too small online if you're not able to come to the Chicago area. I know it says like the minimum suggestion is sixty bucks. You can donate anything you want, a dollar, five dollars, whatever it is. It all helps. Whatever you can um, <coughs> give is incredibly appreciated. And helps the families out uh, in the immensely. Com in the comments, if you uh, use, if you type in HIH for Heels and Heels, we're just throwing it out there now, yep. uh, they're matching up to 500 bucks. Uh, so do that as well. HIH. Uh, and thank you very much to the Heels and Heels for doing that. Thank you, High Spots. Back. Thank you. Kirby <laughs> Pivot is back. Thank you, you very much, Zach Thomas. Our Tees. Our Tees. The uh, Chicago I.O. for hosting us. Of course, us. the I.O. Uh, somebody else I was going to say. I forget what it was, WWE and Dana Warrior for the uh, the shout and the, the interview. Um, the TNA Knockouts Division for a Banner, Kurt Angle. Like Colonel DeBeers. We're just spiraling now. Yep, pretty much. All right. Uh, thank you so much for watching this weird and wonderful wild thing that we do. Um, tune in tomorrow. Uh, again, 1 p.m. is the start time, Central Standard Time. Uh, we look forward to seeing you there. Bye. Peace. See you at the movie store. <laughs> I was going to say.